Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Grand Auto 5 Mods video. Today we're going to be taking our first look at this brand new EMS texture pack by Stobe. I will link it down below in the video description. This thing looks awesome. As you can see, it comes with multiple ambulances plus a paramedic supervisor car over there. So for today's episode, I think I'm going to take out one of the, uh, I think we're going to do one of the Ford ambulances today, but we definitely will do some more videos checking out all of the different ambulances, especially this guy here this thing is huge this is a freight liner ambulance here this thing is nice north los santos paramedics serving the cities of vinewood and rockford very very cool i like the blue and the gray it looks really really nice and uh yeah let's go ahead and get this episode started so we're gonna be using uh fire call outs today to respond to some calls which is pretty useful because it gives us access to just to show you guys over here, we are able to use this stretcher and medic bag. So we have this for our medical calls, plus we have our stretcher for transporting people. And again, everything we'll be using will be linked down below in the video description. So I think we're gonna hop into, I like this one because it has like the blue bumper. That one looks pretty cool. So yeah, let's take that one. And uh, yeah, let's get this episode started guys very very nice so between these two f450s this one just has like a slightly extended cab or f uh oh, it's a 350 actually but yeah slightly extended cab on the right compared to the one on the left and then we got the silverado over here and we got a tahoe over on this side for our supervisor so cool stuff guys let's go ahead and get this episode started i'm going to use let's use this one over here this one looks really cool. Citizens reporting an ambulance requested in Hills. That is right around the corner. We have shots fired between police and suspects. Okay, let's get a respond. Hopefully a code the call is code four. Hopefully the police have it under control already. Let's see what's going on up here. Up oh, scene is secured, okay. Oh, it is safe for us to move in. Oh, boy. What a way to start off our day. We got a shootout here. All right, let's uh, grab our medic bag. Looks like we have one suspect here. More police responding to secure Anyone the scene. Oh, shoot, he got an AK-47. Yeah, I'm going to let them take that. Are you guys okay? Just make sure the officers... Oh, crap. Okay, they're good. They didn't get hit by the gunfire. Alright, let's start treating them. We're gonna do our injury assessment first. I wonder how many rounds he took. This happened like right by the police station and right by the hospital too. Patient is shot in the arm, losing a lot of blood. All right, so let's go ahead and get that tied off. This should help stop the blood. And it says bleeding has stopped. Let's go ahead and replace some of the fluids he lost with an IV pack. Okay. And let me do an airway check. Airway is blocked. Breathing's normal. Pulse is weak. All right, we may need another um, IV first. We're gonna intubate him, and then we'll do another IV. He should be stable after this. Yep, he is stable for transport. Now, the way that they go into the stretcher, it's kind of easier if they're like fully up. So I'm gonna see if we could get him up here. So even though he is already stable, I'm just going to try to treat him some more. And once he fully gets up, then we can put him into the stretcher. Yep, he's up. Alright, looks like he's going to be a survivor. Um, let's get a stretcher now. And we'll go ahead and get him loaded up onto this. And we'll put him back inside. All right, perfect. Uh, let's grab our medical bag. All 
Okay, you guys are good, right? You guys are right? Okay, um, he's gonna be getting transported to Mount Zona if you need to question him or anything like that. Alright, so let's take him to the hospital. Okay, we made it back to the hospital. Okay, let's get him unloaded. All right, guys, we got another call. This one's going to be for a heart attack. We are going to respond. Code 3. Yeah, looks like it's gonna be right up here. Get traffic stuck, and let's talk to the witness here. All right, let's see what she has to say. Did you call 911? Yes, I did. We were walking, and my friend felt a chest pain. There is no movement. Please do something. Okay, well, we'll do our best, ma'am. So let's take a look at her. Let's start with her injury assessment. Possible cardiac arrest here. Okay, yep, she is in cardiac arrest. So let's try to start treating her and giving her CPR. You just don't mess with your betters. Go ahead and flip her over. And we're gonna start chest compressions. Yep, she's up. Perfect. Okay, there we go. It's not over yet, but she's in a better condition now. Let's just check her uh, airway is blocked. Shallow oxygen or shallow breathing pulse is strong. So for this, we are going to continue treating her first by doing that to open up her airway. And next, we're going to get some oxygen flowing and she should be ready for transport now. Our post got a little weak, so we're going to add an IV pack to that, and now she should be good to go. Alright, we got the uh, patient is stable. Let's put her into the ambulance. Alright, you did a good job, ma'am. Calling 911. Whoa, wrong person. There we go. All 
Alright, let's get her. Oh, I'm so sorry, partner. Let's get her to the uh, hospital. Partner's gonna go ahead and stay back there to monitor her conditions. Safely made it to the hospital. Let's get her dropped off. Okay, we're gonna take her inside. Uh, looks like she's gonna be okay. Good job, everyone. That reflection looks really weird. Okay, code four to eight. Back in service. Good job. I really love the livery on this thing. Like, this thing is just so beautiful. I'm just looking at this. I love that back area with the red white and blue there and the EMS logo and then a the logo there too it just looks so nice okay person is feeling sick and needs help respond q3 okay no problem It's always tricky up here in the hills because these are some really hard turns and the roads are so narrow. Okay, looks like we're gonna be on scenes. Turn on our scene lighting. Hello, ma'am. Are you okay? Did you call 911? Yes, I did. I have a terrible headache and a stomach ache. I think something is wrong. Okay, don't worry. We'll take good care of you. Maybe she ate something bad. Let's go ahead and uh, do a quick check up on her. She has a fever. Okay. Um, no pain or nothing like that. That's not too bad of a call. Um, what we can do, I guess we can give you some Tylenol for the pain, ma'am. And I'll, um, I'll give you some fluids, too. Okay. Let's check her vitals. And the airway is blocked. Okay, so you know what? We're actually going to have to do a little bit more, ma'am. We're going to have to do that, which means we're going to have to take her to the hospital now yep she's stable for transport okay so we'll take her to the hospital all right partner let's get going
Now for the next video I do with this pack, let me know what um what um what was I gonna say? What ambulance do you guys think we should use next? We have the Ford or the Freightliner, I mean, which was that really big ambulance. We have the Tahoe, which was like the supervisor. And we also had the Silverado too. So leave some comments down below. Let me know which one you guys want to see me use next. Definitely did enjoy this pack so far. And I'm really excited to use some more of the vehicles. I think I'm most excited to use that Freightliner just because it is huge as well as the Supervisor is pretty cool too. All right, so let's get them back to uh, Mount Zona Hospital. I've rolled code two back since um, this is, I would say this is a kind of a low priority. She is pretty stable, so we don't have to rush too much. Honestly, I wasn't even going to transport her, but since we had to um, put the tube in her, we kind of should now. Dang it. I was doing so well. I messed that up there. Okay, let's get her inside. She should be all good. Alright, code 4 and back in service. Actually, guys, it is midnight game time, so we're going to go ahead and call it a day. Hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Let me know what you guys thought about this new EMS texture pack. If you guys would like to download it, I will link it down below. You can find it linked on my website, acepilot2k7.com. Also, check out my website if you want to see my PC setup, as well as tutorials on how to install all of this and a bunch of other cool content. Definitely check out my website. But thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button leave some comments down below subscribe if you are new and i will see you guys in the next one peace